Hi everyone, it's Miss Kim from the Cumberland Public Library. I'm here to tell you all about what I'm going to be doing the next couple weeks. I'm going to be reading chapter by chapter one of my favorite chapter books. No, it's not Harry Potter, one of my other favorite chapter books. It's called The Boxcar Children. And you might have heard me talk about it before. So here is The Boxcar Children. And it was written in 1924 by Gertrude Chandler Warner. Gertrude Chandler Warner was actually from the town that I grew up in, which is not that far from Cumberland, Rhode Island, it's Putnam, Connecticut. And she was a first grade teacher. And she wrote this, this book for kids in first, second, third, fourth grade. And now kids in third, fourth, fifth, sixth grade love this story. I'm going to read the back to you. It, go, it, it starts like this. One warm night, four children stood in front of the bakery. No one knew them. No one knew where they had come from. And then the rest says, Henry, Jesse, Violet, and Benny are orphans. Determined to make it on their own, they set out to find a safe place to live. They discover an old red boxcar that provides shelter from a storm. Against all odds, they make it into their home and become the boxcar children. So that is the story. We're going to, I'm going to read it chapter by chapter and post a chapter each day. Now there's only 13 chapters, so it'll only take us a little while. Do you know what a boxcar is? It is the car in the middle of the train, not the front or the, the back. It looks like this. The, the car that brings all the, the stuff where the train is going. So the caboose is at the back, engine or the, the locomotive part where the pilot sits, that's at the front. But the boxcar is in the middle and that's where it has all of the stuff. And this was in the middle of the woods. And one warm night, four children, four orphan children were wandering around. Nobody knew them, no one knew where they had come from. And that's the mystery. Who were these kids? Where did they come from? Why are they orphans? So this is a mystery story. We have to figure out who they are, where are their parents, what, where's their family, why did they run away, and why are they living in this boxcar? How did this boxcar get here in the middle of the woods? Who knows? There's all these great questions to ask. And then there, this is a whole series, so maybe we'll continue with this series. I do want to mention I'm reading this with the permission of the publisher, which is very nice of them. It's the Albert Whitman and Company. So I'm excited about that. And if you like this story, there's actually a boxcar museum in Putnam, Connecticut. So um, I've been there several times. Let me show you a picture. So this is what the boxcar museum looks like in Putnam, Connecticut. My head is in the way. But uh, they have done a lot of work on it. And that is what the museum looks like. And that's right in Putnam. Putnam's only 45 minutes away. So we will be reading that and I'm so excited. All right, so I will see you soon. Bye.